Well, merci, Megan. The food looks great over there. The Bastille Day celebration continues down the street at Le Petit Croissant, where you will have a chance to do the all-you-can-eat puff pastry contest. We have Vincent Caradonna here to tell us more about it. Good to see you. Bonjour. Bonjour. Comment allez-vous? Très bien, vous. See, I'm, I'm trying, Megan. I'm trying to learn a little bit of this. So tell us, first of all, welcome to the neighborhood. You guys are you. brand new down the street. Uh, introduce us to that shop. Well, uh, Le Petit Croissant, it's most likely my wife and I. Uh, we built it the shop about a week and a half ago, and uh, it's going to be fine pastry, chocolate, macaron, um, and, and then some art here We've been and saying there, macaron know. wrong the whole time. It's macaron. Macaron. I like that. So <laughs> tell us what you're doing for Bastille Day. You're doing something really cool, mixing both French culture and a little bit of a uh, American culture as well. Right. Uh, so pretty much we came up with this idea that uh, what is most likely really French. And the puff pastry is kind of really Parisian, really French. <laughs> and, uh, and the American uh, typical eating way is like all you can eat, kind of. <laughs> so we're like, why not doing a contest, a food contest, all you can eat puff pastry? And the winner will bring a French symbol, which is a rooster, a rooster. in chocolate uh, that weighed a worst uh, one year worth of chocolate. So this is uh, 10 pounds? This is a 10 pound chocolate, chocolate rooster. This rooster is edible. Exactly, <laughs> entirely. <laughs> and we have some video of you making it. How long did it take you to make it? Uh, it's about an hour process to actually mold it and about two to three hours to paint it to have a nice result. And a you nice did this finish. all in the shop down the street? All in the shop. We're all doing from scratch. Oh my gosh, that, that is really cool. So if you want to, your chance to win this, uh, tell us about this. So the, starting tomorrow, people can come in and pay for the uh, puff pastries, all you can eat. But on Saturday, there will be the actual competition to win the rooster. Exactly, Jamarcus. So we're starting the event tomorrow morning. Uh, all you can eat puff pastries. So you can come at the shop and enjoy all you can eat <laughs> uh, for fourteen ninety five. And we end the, con the uh, that event mm. Saturday at four p.m. I was not expecting that to be like filled with I don't know. <laughs> right. Yeah. It's really good. And so we end the contest at 4 p.m. Saturday with the food contest, all you can eat in two minutes, and the winner will bring Polo home. Polo could be yours if you think you could eat the most puff pastries in two minutes. So they, do they register like at the location? They can just come to, down and, and register there? Do they do it online? or? Uh, you can call us. Uh, you, can find, uh, you can find all the information or, uh, on the website or the Facebook page. Oh my gosh. These are delicious, by the way. I could eat a whole lot of those, so I may have to yeah. pay my 15 bucks and sign up. You can find out more at lepetitcroissantgreenville.com. We'll put more information on our website seen on 7.com. Vincent, thank you so much. Merci. De rien. And we'll see you again real soon. Good luck with this. Uh, someone's going to want to win this. People are probably going to think it's a game cut, but you'll make a tiger as well. I, I will. <laughs> thank you very much.